My name is Ashley Turner and this is my sheep brain dissection for Biology 220. Um, when I received the sheep brain, it looked like this. Um, the dura mater was removed. The arachnoid mater was also removed. And um, the pia mater is still intact here. Um, the scanner's on the so it's a little bit easier for you to see. Um, and uh, so I'm gonna show you just the different lobes. So the frontal lobe is going to be this area up here. Your frontal lobe, of course, is your problem solving, um, motor planning, language production, all of that is in that area. Um, then we have your temporal lobe, which is over here. Your temporal lobe um, is gonna be understanding language, your memory, learning, your feelings, all of that um, over in your temporal lobe. From your temporal lobe, we go into the optical lobe, which is back here, close to the cerebellum. Uh, your optical lobe is back here, and that is um, your visual perception and um, interpretation um, is gonna be in that area. Then we go to the, um, the brain stem, which is right here. Uh, your brain stem, of course, is that vital connection between your brain and your spinal cord. Um, that, your brain stem um, and spinal area, have the breathing, heart rate, um, your blood pressure, all of that um, is controlled in that area. Then, of course, you have your peritoneal lobe, um, which is over in this area. Um, that is going to be um, your... Um, visual perception, your reading and writing, um, your touch, taste, and smell, all of that is gonna be in that area. Um, so then what I did is I dissected the brain um, down the medial longitudinal fissure, so right in this area here. Um, when I did that, I was able um, to see more. Hopefully I can, you can see this. So, um, what I was able to see was the, um, of course you have your spinal cord uh, here on the spinal, uh, whoops, your brain stem, sorry, um, which um, your spinal cord would be off of here. Um, then of course we come into the mandula and the pons. Um, and then from the pons, we go into that midbrain area. And that midbrain area is your visual and auditory. Um, from the midbrain, um, uh, you're gonna see the thalamus. The thalamus is right there. Um, from that, you can see the penile body right here. Um, and then you're also going to see um, that superior coccalus, which is right by the penal body. Um, let's see here. So it's kind of over in this area right here. Um, then um, from there, um, you're going to see the um, that third ventricle, um, which is going to be right above your thalamus. That third ventricle is right there. And then your lateral ventricle is going to be this large one here. It is pretty easy to see. Um, we were able, you're able to open it and see, which is kind of cool. Um, from that, you can see your corpus coliseum, which is right in that area here, um, right along that third ventricle here. Um, then um, from there, you can see um, Let's see, your third ventricle is here. Um, then we're gonna go back to the cerebellum. The cerebellum is here. Um, you can see that tree-like structure, which is your um, arbiter vitae, which is right here, um, which is pretty cool because you can see it really well. Um, from there, um, you can see that fourth ventricle, which is going to be right in here, um, the fourth ventricle. And, um, then you can see your um, gyrus. I'm just gonna show you that here, which is um, these areas. You can see that on the outside as well, but um, these areas here, 
And then in between those areas, those darker areas are going to be the sulcus. Um, and right there. And then between your um, your corpus coliseum, uh, right in this area, um, then you're going to have um, right above this, um, towards the frontier, um, you're going to have the um, septum parasitium, um, which is right in this area here. Um, and then from there, um, you can see the olfactory bulb. It is, I think it's easier to see on this one here. So it is. So the olfactory bulb is going to be right here. Sorry, can't see it. <laughs> right here. Um, and um, yeah, the optic nerve, of course, is not intact in this. Um, but. Um, and then I was able to show you underneath here really quick. Um, I'll just flip this around. So underneath this area, um, you know, it's a little bit easier to see here. Um, you can see your, um, your pons right here, your mandula obligata right in this area. Then of course we go back down um, on this kind of cool you can see um, a little bit of that um, trigeminal nerve um, which would be down in this area from your um, from your uh, pons um, down um, so that's kind of cool and then um, yeah we have all of that um, I also did a cross section so you could see the white matter and the gray matter um, and that is my sheet brain dissection.